Okay, Raptor Freak 13 here. I'm going to go over my uh, Sistema PTW setup. So, what happens here is I got this gun from Gundam Tackleberry off the Sistema PTW forums. He does all these mods and stuff to make the gun a lot more reliable and more accurate and uh, make sure the motor won't fail on me. He also installed a Magpul ASAP sling adapter for me. Uh, again, also what he did was he did the uh, lithium polymer battery mod. So instead of that big uh, NICAD battery that goes in the crane stock in the back, that two, the two long stick thing, there's a single Firefox 11.1 .1, 1200 mAh, yeah, 1200 mAh battery that goes inside the buffer tube, which was actually milled to fit the um, adapter. It doesn't even look like um, an, an individual milled it, it looked like it came like that from the factory. He just did an overall super clean job on the gun and everything. Uh, so right now I'm running um, Madbull. 0.25 match grade BBs, which is what he recommended, and they've been working out great. So right now I've got the uh, heavyweight Sistema magazine, which is the newer ones that support the uh, 0.25 with the stronger spring. Go outside, we're going to chrono the gun with the 0.25. He set the gun to 395 feet per second, so I'm running a blue cylinder, as you can see, but he's modified everything. And he gave me a few spacers too to put in that cylinder if I want to increase or decrease the uh, FPS without any kind of buying a new cylinder or anything. So we're just going to take it outside and chrono it and see how it does. I'm going to do the uh, chrono test as you can see. The points of five maples, which I just showed. So we're going to put it in the gun. That's in there. We'll catch. Okay, so we're going to do a few shots in here. Come behind the gun. Um, behind the gun, just like paintball video. So can you see the gun in the barrel? Yes. Okay, here we go. Okay, so now we're going to do a little rate of fire test. So, okay. Take a look at this. Ready? This uh, trigger is super responsive. It's almost like a uh, paintball trigger, the ones where you uh, walk the gun. So it's almost as responsive as that. You don't even really need auto. So we're going to do now. We're going to corner the gun. Uh, that's 386. Might be a little off there because I'm kind of shaking here. As you can see, it's about 375. A few of the BBs were uh, a little bit heavier, lighter, so it's not going to be 100%. But for the gun itself, it's going to be 270 or 375. But depending on the BB and how consistent it is, it's going to vary a tiny bit. The Mad Bulls, they still have air pockets in them, so every BB isn't quite as consistent weight-wise as they can be, but still work great. So we're just going to finish off the magazine and see what happens. Also, I'd like to show the uh, Magpul ASAP sling adapter, which is right there. Amidextrous sling adapter point, which is great. You see everything? Mm hmm. So, as you can see, gun is on semi, out of BBs. Doesn't shoot. The uh, bull catch will pop up every time. So. Put on safety, there's the magazine, there we go, completely empty. The followers popped up to uh, feed the last PB into the uh, magwell. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks.